What's going on, everybody? Coach Al here, and in the last Dynasty video of NCAA Football 06, we took on BYU crazy game. We were down 14 to nothing. Then we went on a 49 to nothing tear. Just craziness, a lot of turnovers, but was able to pull out the win. We're still ninth in the country. Today we're taking on TCU. We can check out some stats here. They're right there with us talent-wise, but they're having just your most average season. You can tell by their stats, nothing's really special. They got a pretty good run game. Maybe they got an impact running back we got to stop. Who knows? I do know they run the 4-2-5, I think, in this game. So, I forgot what they ran last season. I'm pretty sure it's a 4-2-5, though. So, we'll see what happens there. Big thing is, it's a home game, which means we have at least one guy ready to visit. Looks like we're still number one for this quarterback, but he's not ready to visit yet. But at least we like, at least we know he likes one of our pitches. We're ready for Lorenzo Williams to visit. Let's see, coach or program prestige, coach prestige, and academics. He doesn't care about any of those. He's from Utah. USC, A and M. I don't know what he would play. We can go playing time. We could, let's try playing time. See if we get lucky there. We're number one on his list, and we're ahead by a decent margin. So, as long as we win, I think we'll have a chance to get this guy. Wide receiver, we are technically tied for first for him. But he's not ready to take a visit yet. We're about to run out of home games. If you look here, we got one home game left. It's the last game of the season versus New Mexico. So I'm going to keep the points as is. We're at the top for the quarterback. We're at the top for the fullback, and we're tied here, and he's got majority of the points. So I'm okay with what that looks like. All right, let's go to Sports Illustrated. Finally, we get to see some award semifinalist stuff. Let's look at bowl rankings. They got us ninth. Pretty good deal. Let's go to Heisman Watch. Let's see if... Yeah, we're still one and two. Rocky Hines had six touchdowns, if I'm not mistaken, in the last game. It's not even going to show what he done against BYU. I mean, they, he should have. Let's see. Yeah, they should have put some of his stats there. It was crazy how many yards and touchdowns he had against BYU. But he's one with 39 total touchdowns. Eric Jackson is second with 15 touchdowns. Close to 1,200 yards on the ground. Let's see if we can't keep that going. Let's go to the award semifinals. I'm guessing a few of our players will be on here. Rocky's number one for the Maxwell, and Jackson's number three. The big Narek, Dan Catalano, the man, the myth, the legend. Has just put on a show all season. Yes, I've had a hand in doing that, but I can't think of one guy that I've controlled had that many interceptions. 15 interceptions, 53 tackles, a sack, two touchdowns, nine tackles for loss. Just crazy. Just an incredible season for him. And it looks like Matt Pattinson is six, which is interesting. I guess he's being overshadowed by Catalano. 41 tackles, four sacks, couple picks, three forced fumbles. That helps for sure. Let's keep going. Rocky's at the top of the – quarterback list. Walker. Jackson's at number two. Number one is Jason Gwaltney. West Virginia. 20 total touchdowns. That's the reason why. Touchdowns are king when it comes to awards. Wide receiver. I'm surprised we'd have somebody on here. Marcus Johnson. He's our Z receiver, if I'm not mistaken. He may be our is he our middle? Yeah, I think yeah, he's our Z receiver. I think Wheaton is our slot. I should know this by now. But anyway, it's cool to see him on the list. I didn't even look at his stats. Nine touchdowns, 723 yards. Tight end. We don't go to the tight end enough. Offensive lineman. I don't see anybody there. Remington, that's your top center. Lombardi. This goes to the top defensive lineman. Linebacker, Catalano, Pattinson. I guess the best linebacker duo in the country. You'd have to say that, I guess, with... The way they've been playing. Both of them are seniors. We're going to miss them next year. Thorpe Award. I don't know if we'd have any guys in the secondary who would put up enough stats. 
to do anything there. Groza, no. Punter, no. Returner, no. Anyway, yeah, Peoples is on there. He's got two total touchdowns, but I don't think he has one return for a touchdown. I don't know if the other one. I'm 14 carries, 79 yards, two total. Yeah, he's on there, though. Somehow, somewhat, he's on the list. And we are number one for Coach of the Year. Okay, let's go ahead and I want to check the rosters real quick. Let's check any improvements. We haven't done this in about four or five games. I'm just curious to see if anybody's moved up. Jackson's went up. Peoples has went up a couple. So has Coleman. See, like here's a good example. Coleman, he might have already went up plus two like the last time we looked at this. I don't remember. But he doesn't play hardly at all. Fullback, Cram. A lot of our receivers have gone up. Hmm. Starting to get tight. See, Williams. Well, I do a lot of four and five wide, so he's getting to see the field some. And Flair. This guy's went up three. Of course, the worse you are, the better your chances of moving up overall-wise is. Right tackle, went up plus four. Good for him. A couple guys at plus two. Seniors, we got a lot of seniors. Next year's going to be a bit of a down year, I'm thinking. I mean, we'll still probably win quite a few games, but we just got a lot of seniors playing this season. A lot of the defensive ends went up. Like, Heiss, he's got to play a little bit. Like this kid right here, True Fresh with Jason Williams, he's gone up plus two. I think he was one of the many that we got in the – in the last recruiting class, they had a good, uh, what, what would you call it? He had a good uh, potential rating, if I'm not mistaken. I have to go back and check that. The patents said plus four, good for him. And here are two freshmen, went up a couple, and they're just backups. Catalano, of course, with a couple. Ryan Flash, Flosk, however you want to say that. The guy at the very bottom's got a plus two. Winderquist, that was a good move, switching him over. Apparently, he's really taken on to the playing time at plus two. Now, he may already have the plus two the last time we saw. I'm not I'm not too sure, but it's obvious he needs to be starting, which he is. Safety. Backup, this kid right here is at a plus two. And they got a kicker and the punter. Okay, let's go ahead and take on the Horn Frogs. Still got, what, three games left to go, if I'm not mistaken? This one, New Mexico, and whoever we're playing right after this game. I've already forgot. We can check out some stats here. Oh, they got some players out. They got a kicker out of all things. Is he? looks like he's suspended. I think when it doesn't show anything, that means he's suspended for like a quarter or a half. So he'll get to play today at some point. But they got a strong safety out, a guard out. But they got a three-headed monster on offense. We'll just check out their roster and see how talented they are. Another pretty night, Las Vegas. Hey, football fans, Brad Nessler here with my partners in crime, Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreit. Looks like we finally got the stadium full. We may have had that full for quite a while now. Perfect weather. Just right for the TCU Horn Frogs and the UNLV Rebels. The season's coming to an end as these us in Colorado State. Yeah, that, I, I, that is who we're playing next week. Huge game. Got to beat them next game for sure. Rocky Hines, number eight. He's only eighth in the country in touch. Well, that's his passing touchdowns. He's got a lot of rushing touchdowns, too. All right. Do the coin toss. They won it. They want the ball first, which is fine. Let's check out their roster. Quarterbacks, they've got none that can run, so we're going to go after them. Robert Merrill, first team all conference. I'm guessing everything's going to go through him, so we got to find a way to shut him down. Do a lot of cover one. But they got an impact wide receiver. Now, he's 92 overall. He's 92. 
So they may keep it balanced. Pretty good tight end. Their line is nothing special. Not at all. It's not good. Hopefully we can take advantage of that today. Uh, again, I think they're on a 4-2-5. So 88 and 89 at the end, that's really good for this conference. 80-76 at the tackles. 78 and 82 at the linebackers. Of course, they got this guy too, but I don't think he'll play. I just I forget how the 4-2-5, I'm not mistaken. When you have the 4-2-5 selected as your primary defense, I'm pretty sure it's whoever is right here at left outside, left outside linebacker and middle linebacker are your two starters. Corners, 76, 74, nothing special. 82 at free safety. And the strong safeties, they got, he's out. Oh, we got very lucky here. Their top safety's out. Hmm. And they got nothing behind them. And they got to play at least two guys. So these are the two they're going to play. So that guy's going to be a weakness, just true freshman. And he's out for two quarters, so I was correct on the kicker. Not a bad special teams package there. Okay, let's get this show on the road. Hopefully we'll have a much cleaner game of this go-around than the one against BYU. Okay, now I'm going to approach this as we're going to try to shut down the running back. We can't have him running loose on us all day. So that's what we're going to do. Good stop. Good pursuit by practically everybody on that play. Going four wide, we'll just do quarters out of nickel. Supposedly have the top defense in the country. If I was them, I'd run the ball. Good open field tackle. So it's third and whatever, third and 10. We'll just go cloud. Let's go after this quarterback. We'll go here, there. Uh-oh, good throw. That's a great throw. He looked open, yeah. It's right where it needed to be. Four wide. Let's go one high. It's first and ten. I have a feeling they're going to run it. They come out with four wide out. Told you. There. Woo! About eight yards there. That was a good tackle. All right, let's go back to a one high out of four three. Two coming up here, and this is the fifth play of the current drive. Single set back to you. Crap, he's gone. Catalano had to make the tackle. Let's go back to one high. Looks like they're going goal line. That was a sweet juke. Well, I was correct. They're going to go to their running back all night. And we're feeling it out of the gate. So, Well, it's not a good start. The running back done everything on that drive. Of course, it all kind of started with that big bomb. On the right side on third and long. I'm not too worried about that yet. We'll continue to do it one high until we may have to change it, but we'll see. All right, let's get an offense and see if we can't tie this thing up. Let's go, peoples. That's 
That's a good run out of the gate. Let's go. Let's go here. Let's do Lonnie. They're going man. Now their corners are backed up really high, so. Oh, I threw that way too hard. Way, way too hard. Let's just do option, try to make up for that. They're going man at least. They got a safety hanging over there. Ooh, I had to pitch it. I had to pitch it. That's a good run. Let's go play action meals. It's on my mind. They're going man nickel. And are at least going one high. I didn't want him double teamed. Johnson is double teamed. No. Let's throw that out. Yeah, I'll just throw it away. Be done with it. Let's go. Ooh, we could try slam. We're going dime. Okay. We're doing that. I guess we're going to go right. Ah, great. Wow, what do you do about that? That's just an awesome play by the nickel. Third and long. We're going zone. We're going to try to get this over the middle if we can. Good catch. Woo! Okay, we're on the right hash. Let's go fork. We're going man. And they're going to have that guy sitting over there. So let's try... Let's have him do that. Perfect throw! Ah! Ah! By the corner! Six points! What a throw! Man, that was perfect as soon as I released it. Right where it needed to be. Golly, what a throw. Mm. Oh, wow. That just flashbacks of Danny Warfel to I kill you in the corner. Oh, my gosh. And that's not a good memory for me, being a Tennessee fan. I had to live through that for years and years. But gosh, what a throw that was. Okay, now let's get on defense and try to get a stop. Their impact guys are their starting kickoff returners, so it doesn't matter who we kick to. We're gonna probably go do some damage with it. All right, let's go back to one high. Good stop. They went with that halfback read play, though. It's not a good play. Keep calling it, though, please. Let's see. Just go back to another one high. Exact same play. I'll be. Keep doing it. All right, now it's third and long. we got to get a stop. We're going to go cloud again. Last time, he done a really good job. Against it. Sack! Bo Bell. Oh, and he's hurt. Now, their backup can't run either, so I'm not too worried. That's for a sack Bale's had in a while. I don't remember his name being called lately. I could be dead wrong. He's had a really good season. All right, that's a good stop, so let's get the ball back. Let's get back on offense. Gosh, what a punt. Somebody get a... Mm. Oh, oh, I know what was happening there. Okay, let's just stay here. Let's just run slam. We're going man. Doing that, we're gonna run right. No, we're gonna have to go to the outside. I was wanting to cut up, but that that defender done a really good job cut me off there. Still got the first. Let's go with Corkers. We're going zone. 
quarterback's out for a half. No, intercepted. That's just overthrown. That's what I was wanting to go. Cover two, I wanted to go to him, but it wasn't a very good throw. I wanted him to go more to the sideline, and it just didn't happen. Uh, let's do speed option this time. We're going man dime. Interesting. Please shift to the left. Thank you. We're going to go to the right. Pick up the first. We're on the right hash. I want to go back. No. Let's go five wide. Let's go back to Corkers. We're going zone again. I had to throw that one quick. I was fixed to get sacked. We got a few yards out of it. I want to stay here, and I want to go to corners. We're going to flip it. We're going man. I'd love to go to Kirkland. Now, who's on Jackson? Nobody. Nobody's on Jackson. Six points. Go. Go. We've got to break this play down. This was kind of weird. I have Cur or a Jackson going on a flat route, or a flare, or a, a, technically a flat, and I can't tell who's on him. I'm assuming this defender is on this guy, and this guy is on Kirkland. So I couldn't tell this linebacker was on Jackson. So that was a good read by me. Just dump it to him and let him take it. Nice. Awesome. We'll take it. Good deal. Let's get an extra point. Let's get back on defense. That's a good read. I need to practice a little bit more on that. Maybe that's just against a 4-2-5 kind of thing, but either way. Really strong kick, but I'm sure it'll be returned. Get it! I was hoping to get the tackle with the kicker. I got close. We're going to go back to a one high. Uh-oh. <laughs> Scares me half the day at the open field tackles. Flaga, 39. Is he a defensive end? And yeah, we'll wait. We'll see how badly injured he is. Once we get the report. All right, end of the quarter. We're up a touchdown. I'm okay with it. We're going to go back to one high. I fully expect him to run it. What in the world? It said they was going four wide. If they score a touchdown here, I'm going to get upset. I'm calling a timeout. I'm not going to let that happen. It said they were going four wide. You go back and watch. Look, it says four wide. I swore that's what it said in the previous play. And they went power eye. That's more like it. Nope, when you flip that. There we go. Good open field tackle by Catalano. Second and six. I'm still going to go one high. Second and six coming up here. Ball on their own 39. Number 14 with three wide receivers. Back to back. Goes right. He's looking. He's going right. Oh, crap. Couldn't get to the quarterback. He just made a good throw, and I couldn't get over there in time. So good play by them. Now it says they're going zero wide receiver, so they should be going power eye here. And they are. Good hit! Huh? I'm still going to go one high. I still think they're going to run it. Big 
I don't trust that running back. First down. That's a good way to beat me. I'll just be honest. Is you have a good balanced game where I have to go cover one high. Then you go to the pass game to that. And use man beaters. And that's what they're doing right there. But I feel like I gotta go cover one just because of this running back. Ah crap. I completely blew that one. <laughs> he just ran right by me. We're not gonna watch that again. Oh, okay. We'll just get back on offense and try to get the lead. And he tacks on the extra point. And now we'll take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. It goes to show you, I, I, I remember somebody made a comment where they just think as a as a whole the game doesn't run the ball enough. The def or the CPU doesn't run the ball enough. It all depends on the roster, you know. If you got an impact running back, they're gonna give him the ball one way or another. And that's what they're doing. They're doing a good job of it. Right, let's do an option. We're going nickel zone. I guess we're gonna go left. Go, Hines! Go! 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 Take it to the house, eight! Heisman! Heisman run right there. Uh, what a play! A little juke to the right, and he's gone. Awesome play from Mr. Hines. That's how you get the lead back right there. Now we got to figure out what to do on defense. They're doing a pretty good job. Maybe I need, I, I don't know. I may mix in some things, but they're doing a lot of heavy sets. So I'm automatically thinking they're going to run the ball. But they're keeping their, we can check the stats real quick. They feel balanced to me. No, they're, it's 11 of 5. They're running the ball a whole lot more. But they're five of five in the pass game. I mean, their pass game is really killing it. So we got to figure that out. That's not a strong kick at all. Get him! All right. I'm gonna go one high. They're going too wide. I think it's the first time we've seen Ace Normal today. Ace backfield. Play action. Watch the throw outside. What do you do? One high, I tell you, man beater. And that's their backup quarterback. You go back to that my second to last year at Indiana. I got beat by Minnesota and USC, and that's exactly how they beat me. They ran the ball, forced me to go man, and then they went over the top on me. That's how you do it. Let's just keep going one high for now. I'm going to mix in some zone eventually, but... Now eh, let's switch that back up. Yeah, I had to go for the halfback on that one. Let the quarterback take it. That's fine. Let's do quarters to see what happens. Do an over front. Dang it. Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. Had to chase him down and make the tackle. I'm going to try a zone blitz. They'll either run it and beat it, or we can get a good stop. So that's what we'll try to do here. I'm guessing they're going to run it, but i got to take a, do something different. Crap, somebody tackle him. He's going to have 250 yards by the time it's over with. He's already got over 100. I'm going to do another zone blitz. I'm going to just take a chance. They're about to score anyways, so. Oh, 
Oh, man, we could have used that. Huh. I'm going to do another zone blitz. Just run the same thing. Now, if I was them, I would run the ball right here. And that's what they're doing. I took a chance, and it just didn't work. All righty. It said they was going two wide, two, and they went 22 personnel. So it lied to me again. So I can only go by what they supposedly tell me. Okay, tie ball game. Neither defense is playing great, <laughs> obviously. So I'm going to run some clock, possibly. We get the ball started the second half. I'd like to chew down these next two minutes. Score touchdown, go up, and to get the ball back in the third. Let's just go option again. 4-2-5, they're going zone. Yeah, we'll still go this way. That's good defense. Uh, we can try. Let's go back to Corkers. We're going zone. I'm still going to run clock. Even if I don't convert, I still want to run it. I'd love to go over the middle here, but it just depends on what this linebacker is going to do. You got to make the catch, buddy. All right, it's third and seven. I am going to go fork. Just because I want Rocky to be able to run it if needed. Uh, yeah, we're just going to let him run it. All right, we picked up the first minute and a half. Now we got to get with it. Let's go Lonnie. We're going man. But the corners are up. Oh, what a catch by Kirkland. What, the accuracy it wasn't really what I was wanting. I was wanting to go more to the sideline, but it was more like a fade in a way. We'll take it. We will take it. Let's go five semi. We're going zone. This could get interesting. So close. Oh, my gosh, what a throw that was. We'll, we'll break this play down. One thing i got to show you. Now, they're in the 4-2-5, so they're going zone. But I noticed this safety right here coming down to right here. So I was immediately thinking cover three, but he was going way too down. So he's not in zone. He's covering somebody. Now, he, they are in zone, but he's just covering the short middle. But then at this stage, I was looking at two safeties. So obviously they're going to cover two. So now I was just buying my time until Kirkland or uh, Wheaton got the ball right here. And he almost got the touchdown. So we're close to the goal line, so you know what this means. We're going to go with the fade out. They're going zone, but they're going goal line, so we're going to do it anyways. We're going to run some clock. UNLV sets up in the eye. And hopefully that corner won't mess us up here. Hopefully we can get it off in time, too. Six points. Wasn't the best throw, but we got it in. We can break this play down. Again, they're going goal line zone. So I knew he was going to be open, and I threw it kind of hard. I didn't want to lob it. Otherwise, it was going to go out of bounds and almost went out of bounds. You can see right here. Just enough. <laughs> All right, they still got 45 seconds left, so I don't know if they're going to try to make something of it. I'm guessing they will. We got to stop it somehow. So I think Rocky has accounted for all four touchdowns, which is pretty cool. He may have another four in the second half. Who knows? Got to get a stop here. 
Uh oh. Now, I may. Let's just do quarters. I know they got a hanging tight end, but let's just keep it centric here. Play action. And good, oh, good hit. That was a good throw, right where it needed to be. I'm going to stick with the quarters. Now, I, I can actually see them running here. This may be a bad idea. Quarters can handle the run game, depending, sort of. Yep, they're going to run it. Oh, look at this. Look at this. There we go. You ain't get past 35. Call a timeout. They're not calling a timeout, so we're going to call a timeout. We're going to go with a cover of one. Surely they will run it here. Play action. They went play action. I did not expect that. So now they are in passing mode. And they're going too wide. It says two tight ends. So we're going to go quarters at a 4 3. And they're going 22 personnel. Carolinas all over the field. Ah! They call another timeout. 20 seconds. Um, let's just do quarters again. This time at a nickel. Somehow that wasn't a sack. I'm going to let that clock roll. I don't know what they're going to try to do here, to be honest. They're doing that. Oh, my gosh. End of the half, though. Good. All right. We're up a touchdown. It could be worse. They're offensively. Look, they got 254 yards of offense. I mean, they're moving it on as easily. They're running the ball really well, and they're throwing the ball even more efficiently. But our offense is killing it right now. We can check the stats. 7 of 11, three touchdowns, zero picks for Rocky Hines. Only 150 yards, but every other completion is a touchdown, basically. Rushing, Hines, 110 yards and a touchdown. I mean, it's his show today for sure. And Catalano already has seven tackles. That's insane. What a beast. All right, we get the ball back. Got to get a touchdown here. Get some separation. Let's go, peoples. Nope. Oh, couldn't get through it. Left hash. What have we called today? I'm trying to think. Oh, we haven't called corners from Pro Normal yet. They're going man. Again, their corners are very high, so. Ah. That was my bad. I didn't get it off in time, I guess. Let's go with an option. We're going man. That's good, but we got to watch out for this safety on this far side. They're shifting that way. Let's just give this to Jackson. Just pick up the first, be done with it. Right, let's go back and give him the ball again. Let's go slam. And they're going 4-2-5. That's what I was worried about. I was hoping to go dime. I don't know. Let's do that. That's just good defense. Uh, let's go back to corners. I'm going to flip it. They're going Second zone. Ball on the 32. Ooh, let's see what happens here. UNLV lines up for the shotgun set. Looking. Ooh. Oh, man, we got lucky on that one. Go! 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 Take it to the house, William. Six points. You got to be kidding. Another touchdown for number eight. Wow. 
Wasn't expecting that. I was fixed to get sacked. Oh, he over pursued like I've done the last couple of plays in the first half. Wow, what a play. Funny gun. It's alive and well. Extra point. All right, let's get on defense, figure out how to stop him. It's just a night and day difference between these last two games. The BYU game, how many turnovers were there? This game, there hasn't been a single one, which is fine by me for either team. It's been a real clean game for both teams. All right, they're going three wide. I'll just do quarters. Please pass, I dare you. Uh, first down to the fullback of all people. Um, let's stick with quarters again. It says they was going three wide. And they do that. Oh, that kills me when they do that. We're lucky that we got to stop on that one. I'm going to do a zone blitz. I'm going to take a chance. Yeah, I'm going to control Catalana this time. I'm not going to control the defensive end. Good play by Patson. Or Faga. My bad. Faga's back. He was hurt earlier. All right, let's go, Cloud. Got to get a stop here. Third and long is what you're wanting. Has four receivers lined up here. Back to get him! Oh, what a catch. What a throw. I'll be. They're quarterbacks. You're playing good. They're converting third downs. You know, what do you do? All right, let's go one high. I think it's time for them to run it. It says they was going at least three wide, and they're doing that. Oh, that kills me. Go back and look at it. Oh, no. 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 I couldn't get over there in time. Dang it. That really ticks me off. It says they was going three wide or four wide, and they went to 22 personnel. It's hard to call a defense where they're lying to you. I'll be. Uh, I, I'm, I think I'm going to go back and look at the video. How many times have they just done the complete opposite? Instead of they're going three wide, then they'll go with a power eye or whatnot. That's, that rarely happens. I know they do that because they're subbing people out, using sub packages, but still. Just going to let that one go. Let's just do option. They're having a hard time against it. They're going zone this time, though. This time, uh, let's just stick with it. See what happens. Ooh, cut through. Second and one. Let's stay here and let's go to fork. It's on my mind. They're going man. They keep going man every time I call this play. And they got a safety hanging over there and they spread out. And they're doing that. Didn't get the first. I was trying to get the first and it didn't work. Third and one. Oh, gosh. Can we get the first with the slam with Jackson? I have my doubts, I'll be honest. Told you. I told you. I told you it was going to happen. Came right on through. We'll punt it. I should have let Rocky handle it. I should have went with an option. I just had a feeling that slam wasn't going to work. And this is going to be a terrible kick, my gosh. We're falling apart. Third quarter, been a disaster so far. All right, two wide receivers, two tight ends. They better go with that personnel. Oh, I've got to go cover one. I mean, I feel like they're going to run it. 
Go play action. Hi, B. Man. Okay, forget this. Mm. Let's just go zone. Cover one just isn't working because they're going to play action on me every time I call it. You got to be kidding. Come on, really? Everything's going right for them offensively. I mean, just doesn't matter what we call. Good stop there. Yeah, he had two guys all over him. Okay. I'm going to go quarters. If I was them, I'd run it. And it wouldn't shock me if they did, but I'm afraid if I go cover one, they'll just go play action and they'll go over the top. Look at this. Third and whatever. Third and ten. Uh, I guess we'll go cloud. I'm I'll try it with Bale this time. Kick a field goal, please. Kick a field goal. That's the best stop we've had all night. I was thought for sure they was going to score a touchdown here. And they may fake it. So be on the lookout. Okay, so it looks like Rocky's got to do everything. Jackson just screwed the pooch on that slam play. Of course... He had no blocking either, but keeping it tight for sure. Right down the middle again. I'm just gonna let that one go. I just I'll never get anything out of him running up the middle. Let's just go speed option this time. We're going man dime. Shift to the right. That's okay. Both safeties coming up. Oh, no! Woo. Another fumble! No! Oh, my gosh. I'm about to lose it. What's going on? Let's go corners. They're going mad, but they're doing the 4-2-5, so. Play didn't work too well last time. They're going cover two. I don't like what I'm seeing. Pick up the first. Let's do a basic run with Jackson. Can he handle that? Let's go slam. We're going man. We're going nickel. They're doing that. Somebody's going to move over. There we go. Both safeties are coming up. I got to go to the outside. Good run by Jackson. We are on the 16-yard line. I'm going to go five wide, and I'm going to go corners. They're going man. And I may go to Jackson here. Nobody is on Jackson. Great play. Exact same as the last touchdown to Jackson. They went man and nobody's on him. The linebacker is on him. So I just do an immediate press. Actually wasn't a good throw. He had to stop for it. First down. Ten seconds, third quarter. Let's go. We'll do a fade out. We're on the right hash, so we'll flip it. We're going zone. This should work like last time. Intercepted. That was a good catch. Good coverage by the corner, though. Really good play. Uh, let's just run it. We'll give the Jackson. I just want the touchdown. I want that kid on my team. I guess we're no way up. All right. We're up 10. Let's go up 11. Let's 
get back on defense, and at least try to force a field goal. Because right now, their offense, this is the best offense I've seen all year, for sure. I mean, they're just running all over us. Passing game, running game, they're doing a good job. So my hat's off to them to this point. Now, they may lay an egg here in the fourth quarter. I hope they do, but they've been consistent. I'll give them that. It just it feels like they've been really balanced, even though they've been running the ball more. That was a good kick, but there we go. Let's do a one high. That's why in a cover one, I want very fast safeties. That's a good tackle. So they can handle all that space at the back end. Right now, I don't have fast safeties. I need to recruit better and faster safeties. Now, I'm going to do quarters here. Please pass. I want you to pass. Uh, could be worse, I guess. So it's third and four. I'm going to stick with quarters. I know it's third, but I, I can see them running it. I can see them throwing it. So I'm going to do something neutral and just do quarters. Good play. Full back dive. Who would have thunk it? They got a hang it tight end. I'm going to go with the zone blitz. I'm going to take a chance. Oh, good play by the corner. They went with a halfback pass. I'm going to go back to... Hmm, let's just do quarters. I think they're going to do a basic run here, but we'll do quarters. And the secondary better be careful. This receiver wants to make a play. Catalano just got ran over. Good stop. All right, third and long. They've done a great job with my cloud. We're going to flip it this time. Let's see how they handle it. Sometimes this works, sometimes it doesn't. Oh, it worked. Something happened. He got spooked and he threw it quick. I guess he was feeling the heat and he threw it off quick. Awesome. Okay. We got four minutes to go. Let's run the ball. We're going zone nickel. We're going basic slam. We'll just go left. Good pick up there. Pick up seven. They keep it on the ground and the halfback gets about seven yards. Let's do an option from spread. Let's run some clock. We're going man, and they're bringing him up. So we're going to go, and they're doing that. So I don't know. Hmm. We'll stick with it. Let's just see what they do. They're going zone. This play doesn't work well against zone. We'll get the first. Sometimes, the, if you call an audible, sometimes the defense will call an audible. That's what they've done right there. Not every time, but sometimes they'll do it. And that play was not meant for zone on that hash. I can tell you that much. So I wasn't paying attention. Are they doing zone? They're going man. And they're bringing both safeties. I'm going to go back to the same play. And they may be going zone again. Let's just see. They're going zone. We'll just go, Jackson. <laughs> Second and one. Let's keep running the ball. We're going man. Everybody and their brother shifting that way, so I guess we're going right. Let the clock roll a little bit, then we're going to start throwing. Once we get down 30 yards and in, we're going to go fun and gun on them. And try to end this thing. Right tackle didn't do a good job right there. Big stiff arm. Oh, great play by Jackson. It is a Heisman run. 
I don't think he's going to win it, though. Not with his teammate in the fold. All right, you know what we're going to do? We're going to try to fade out. We're going zone. We're going to try to go back to Kirkland. The clock has stopped. Nice. Another fade out touchdown to 21. Awesome. Quarterback actually done a decent job here. Just wasn't enough. Okay, I like her lead. I feel a little bit more comfortable. Still got two over two minutes to go. Anything's possible, but I like what I'm seeing. Only took off a minute and a half. That Jackson run <laughs> took up a chunk of yardage. Not the strongest kick. Going to the wide receiver. Wide receiver hasn't done a whole lot today. Well, I could I'll take that back. He probably was the one who made that big touchdown on the left side a couple quarters ago. I don't remember. But either way. They got some good players. I don't know how they're four and four. Maybe because their defense isn't good. I don't know. Ooh! Oh, so close! Could have got interception number sixteen. Let's just stick with quarters. Good defense. Almost got picked. Now Rankin is hurt. His chest. Hopefully that's not too serious. We'll go Cloud. Let's go after this quarterback. Intercept that. Uh-oh. Oh, you got to be kidding. Look at this. Somehow he got the first down. <laughs> what do you do? Ooh, they're doing this. Okay, this is going to be interesting. Call timeout. We was going to get off sides there. We had a guy hanging there. So we're going to keep it basic and just do quarters from here on out. Now that they are in hurry up mode. Throw it my direction. That's a good open field tackle. That's the good thing about quarters. It's balanced. You can just keep doing what you're doing with it. You can attack anything. Play action. No, it's a run. I thought we'd play action there. Fooled me. Uh, let's try Cloud again. I'm, I'm guessing they're going to pass. They only need two yards, but... Great play, great throw. Cover two on that side. That's why it's called a cover six. It's cover two on one side with a cover four on the other. Uh, oh, I almost had him. I'll be. Look at this. They're just going right down the field on us. I should do quarters. Ooh, almost picked off. Super close. Uh, yeah, let's just stick with quarters. Their backup quarterbacks had a great game, in my opinion. Oh, no, that's their first stringer. He's back. Both quarterbacks have played well. Intercept that. That's a good stop. Now Butler's hurt. We're losing bodies. They're doing, uh, let's go, I'm going to just take a chance here. Where's that? 
Can't find it. Let's go fire two. It's been forever since I've called this. I'm going to control Catalano. This quarterback's got to get it off quick. Or the, watch him run the ball. Nah. It's a good play. Yeah, that was my fault. I could have made a tackle there, I guess. Yeah, they're doing... Let's just go with man lock. Yeah, that was too easy. 52 seconds, they're down 10. They're going to go for an onside kick. Don't do anything stupid here. Just let that one go. There we go. That's what we want right there. So now we're just going to run clock. They're going to... How many timeouts have they used? Have they used any? They got two timeouts left. So let's just give the Jackson. Let him do his thing. We're going nickel. Let's go right. Or left. Sorry. Here we call timeout. Let's go offensive line. Let's just run slam again. If we get a first down, then we could go to victory formation. We're going to go left. Just stay in bounds. That's what we want out there. All right, good game. Kudos to TCU. They gave me a heck of a game. I'll give them that. Let's go to the victory formation. Sometimes if you go, I always go hurry up on these situations just because sometimes one of their defenders may get caught in the backfield and you could get an offsides called. But it doesn't happen hardly at all, but it can happen from time to time. Plus, it just saves me time for having to select this play over and over again. And you're not losing seconds, if that makes sense. All right, great game. We'll check the stats. Stay to the end of the video. We'll see if we'll get a commitment from the fullback. I think he's the one who's visiting today. Great game. Now the next one is a huge game. Colorado State, a lone loss from last season. I'm seeking revenge. I'm going to try to beat it by 50 in the first half. Maybe beat it by 100 in the second if I can. That'll be in the next 06 video. Uh, all right, we had over 500 yards, but look at their offense. They just killed it today. Look how balanced they were. They threw the ball incredibly well. I mean, our biggest problem, we couldn't get to the quarterback. And I thought their offensive line was supposed to be bad, but I, their offensive line, they done their job, and their quarterbacks played well. Big thing is only one turnover on the day between both teams. It was a pretty clean game. All right, Hines, 11 to 17, 249 yards, five touched. They had more importantly, no picks. 142 yards and 135 for the backfield, one touchdown apiece. Just looking at the receptions here. As you can tell, this offense is a lot like the air, sorry, the air raid. I got the hiccups. It's sort of like the air raid. It's pretty balanced as to who's going to get the ball. It's not really meant to isolate one receiver. And oddly enough, Catalano, sorry, Catalano didn't have one single tackle in the second half. Winterquist, our safety, ended up having the better game because it had the interception. But your free safety should never be the one being the leading tackler. That means you had a bad defensive game. Okay. We had a couple guys hurt, but they never said anything about them, so I need to check on those. <clears throat> Again, sorry, hiccups. <laughs> nope, we're going to simulate the week. 
my next video will either be tomorrow night or Saturday. It'll be the MVP 07 video. The next one, I had a lot of excellent feedback from a lot of you guys about how to help because baseball is not my strongest suit, and it's been years since I played any baseball games. But I got a lot of good, a lot of good tips. I'm gonna start using. We'll cover all that in that video, which, again, will be either tomorrow night or Saturday morning. I got to make a lot of changes in that before the next game. So I don't know if I'm going to squeeze in two games or not. Good deal. We got the commitment from the fullback. Next game at Colorado State. They're eight and two. Huge game for us. Let's go to recruiting. Comes down to these two guys. I'm gonna do forty here. We're gonna do sixty here. We need more help for this receiver. And then we do the quarterback. We'll schedule their visits in the upcoming video. For 06. So come on back. We'll take on the Rams. Biggest game of the season. Hopefully we can get the job done. All right, guys. I'll talk to you later.